we are going to learn about how to record audio in Audacity. Audacity is the best free program available for audio recording and editing. Audacity is available in the most of the major OS. So you download and install Audacity to your local machine. I am not going to discuss in details how to install Audacity on your system. It is as typical as any other software in your OS. When you open Audacity for the first time, you will see this welcome pop-up. This pop-up has a video about the latest Audacity, the changes about the latest Audacity, and it has some links to online forum and online manual, which is good for advanced level learning. The recording is as simple as pressing this red record button. You have to take care of certain things. For example, you have to select the correct microphone, uh, you have to select the correct recording volume, and you have to select a sample rate. So I am going through all the process. To set the microphone for your recording, go to audio setup and from the recording device, select the microphone you want to use. There will be a check mark beside the microphone name. That means this microphone is selected. So if you want to select any other microphone, go there and select that. After setting the recording device, set the recording channel. You will see mainly two options, mono and stereo. Though for my Samsung mic, only mono recording channel is available. But if you switch back to another microphone, you may see that stereo option is available. Though for voiceover, it is not required to record in stereo channel and for voiceover, mono is fine. So keep things simple. Always record your voiceover in mono. And then you have to set the sample rate for your recording. 44.1 kHz works fine and you actually do not need to go behind that. All the amazing music you will listen through the mp3s are actually sampled to 44.1 kHz. But when you are new to audio recording, you may think that a higher sample rate will give you a better audio recording, but that is not the case. A higher sample rate will take lots of disk space in your machine. So if you do not know exactly why you need a higher sample rate, then you stick to the 44.1 kHz or 48 kHz. When you click start monitoring, it is actually not recording. It is showing you how loud the microphone is capturing your sound. If you decrease that slider, then the gain level or the recording level will be low. For recording, your target recording level should be minus 24 to minus 12. So if you get that kind of gain from your microphone or the recording setup, that is good and that will leave a room for post-processing. Because in the post-processing, you might need to boost some of the frequency or some of the audio levels. For example, if you record it close to the zero and if you add gain after that, then it will cross the zero and it will add distortion or clipping to your sound. So if you record between minus 24 to minus 12, that is most of the time good for post-processing. So when you see that you are not hitting this level in the microphone, maybe you need to talk closer to the microphone or you may need to talk from a different direction. Uh, this kind of adjustment you may need to make. I normally keep this slider in the highest point because that's how I get the desired recording level in this meter. So you can click again and you can stop monitoring if everything is set. So everything is set and I can now start recording. It is a good idea to record some silent part at the beginning. So when you are done with recording, you can click this stop button and the recording will stop. So this is the your audio, this is recorded and if you want to uh, listen to it, you can just click at any point and press the space bar, the recording will start playing. Uh, it is a good idea to record some silent part at the beginning and the thing that is recording now is uh, called the thing that is recording now. So that was the basic of the audio recording in Audacity. I have to become a bit comfortable of recording my own voice and this tutorial. So I'll keep this uh, video short today and uh, in future I will post more video tutorials about Audacity. Thanks for watching and see you next.